Welcome back, everyone. Just watching the sunrise. So we got our crops are slowly growing. It hasn't rained in a while, so I'll have to get some sort of water to them. Got this stuff organized a little bit. I ate the berries that were in here because they were going to go bad today, so might as well. I uh, still got quite a bit of mushrooms. Ended up making another meal. And I turned all the vines into monkey bridges with one rope left over. Because this is probably what I might use to get between the different islands. So let's go do some more exploring. See what else we got out here that we can get. Yeah, I don't know if these villagers are just dying out here or they're just running away or coming out and sleeping outside for some reason. Yeah, they must just be sleeping. This is the way I went last time, so I think I want to go that way. Still haven't found that ruin with the tool chest yet. Just hope I don't run into anything that's going to kill me. I think last time we stopped around here. Little dead baby chick. See if we can at least get something from it. Nope, not even bones. Lurch tree. this way. Yeah, it's kind of weird that it hasn't rained in a while since the bio thing there. It says rains almost all the time. The other thing I forgot to do was to Put some of these vines on the wall to see if I can get them to start growing. I still have not tested that out yet. I'll probably use a lot of those vines to make bridges. Actually, two of them. Kind of fruits that. Apples. More apples. I think that's the the urn that I'm looking for. Hopefully, I get lucky with some really good tools to start off with. So 
So it looks like just flint shovels. Yep. Just shovels. So let's go ahead and Set them up against this. There we go. Let's just keep. Come on, there you go. We'll just keep the one. We'll leave these ones here. Guess I ever need to come out and get a shovel. We'll know where they are. Another lurch tree. I kind of want to dig this out a little bit, but with being as close to this edge as it is, I don't want great uh, land uh, collapse in the land falling down I think trying to go maybe that way I collect a lot of these ferns so that I can burn them. Stick to the, the edge out here. some pine trees so it's not just all one type of larch tree and that I think is predator so we'll just stay away from him Probably should just head back. I think this is getting a little too too thick for me. Can't really see that well. Don't want to run into the mouth of a hungry bear. Just like that. Unless I had some sort of trap to where I could run and he'd fall off of it. No, that's not a bear. I think that's a dire wolf. So we're just going to leave him alone. We'll 
I'll just head back this way. already. It's not too bad. Because it takes three to make one rope and then two to make a cordage. Oop. We got another hollow tree. These ones really quick. It says I can just pick it up, so let's see if that's true. Rest of gear. Proceed. No, so we're gonna have to cut it down. But this will give us our second hollow tree chest. Along with the storage vessel. So we'll have one that we can keep with us and the one that we can leave there. Which I forgot to pick that one up when we came out here. This way until I get to where I was last time and then just skirt around the, the island a little bit. trees. Because that's probably for a while how we're going to get a lot of our storage. So here's where I stopped yesterday. So let's continue on this way. Found some water. Some fresh water. Which I think that there's a bucket back at the um, village. 
And somebody did let me know that you can take stuff from them, so... We should not have to worry about them getting mad if we take the bucket. Oh, and there's another hollow tree. Hopefully there's nothing around us. Quite a few things on it. And this is probably how we get a lot of seeds as well. it down and then put it back on my back because I already got one. So we don't really need the rotting stuff but it would be nice to get that seed. Actually I got something on my that it's a ethernal gear which I have no idea what that is but we'll go ahead and keep it let's get back over to the the village and drop this chest off so here's where it'd be nice to make a a bridge but I don't really need one because I can just walk around this way and then there's the village right there let's, let's just go ahead and run back This will burn a little bit of my food, but I think we're sitting pretty good on that for right now. stuff before the sun sets. That way I don't put it to waste. Gotta be careful to stay away from that guy. Get too close and they end up taking a shot at you. Time to eat. all over the place. Sometimes I don't pick up the ones that are right there or cut down every single vine I see. Okay, 
Okay, so this is seed. We'll go ahead and keep that. Rot. I don't know if we really need the rot, but might as well take it. So we got over here. Probably have to build a bridge to get over to this stuff. Got another apple tree. Kind of feel bad for a lot of these animals because they're gonna try to run away from me and just run right off the edge. Some weird physics right there. I can already see you some. What was that? I can already see you some ore right there. Enough to make it across, and I hope that this doesn't collapse on me. So we'll finish this little bridge. I kind of want to see what that ore is. And then I gotta start heading back because I don't have mo any more food on me. Another bridge here to over there. I think that might be another town over that way. Okay, let's get this dirt placed. Switch that out of my main hand so I'm not using as much my food gauge. And it's time to run back while I slowly starve to death. And hopefully I don't run off the edge since now it's getting nighttime. I'll have to remember to bring a lot more food next time. That's the edge.
There we go. That's where we're gonna go. And I think it might be... Is it raining? No, it just seemed like it was gonna start raining. Or maybe it's raining behind me and not over here. Let's get this bowl ready. So I can just run in, grab the food, and start eating it. starving anymore. So now I need to plant all of these. Let's go ahead and set the bowl down. Go ahead and plant this tree. Let's plant it right there. So, all the food we got, none. Gotta plant that bush. All these seeds. some of these vines, see if they'll grow. And then if not, we'll have to just turn them into rope. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, and the hoe I left, and there we go. Uh, that can't be placed on just packed dirt. Three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, yep. Get some more of this medium fertility soil. Expand the garden a little bit. Hopefully it will rain at some point. Actually what I can do is take out this block. that bucket which I believe is just right out here by the well which that's this way I think And we'll just 
make a little moisture block in the middle and then that way we don't gotta wait on it to rain because it can go up to two blocks so that'll be good that way and that way there we go and we'll get another at least just one piece of this so we get this last seed planted Now we got a garden that will always get moisture because of the one thing in the middle. I completely forgot to add firewood out here. But that's where I'm going to call it for this one and I will see you guys in the next one.